The Wells Fargo Bank has agreed to pay billions of dollars to settle charges that had harmed consumers by charging illegal interest and fees. Here are the details by the numbers. More than $2 billion, that's how much the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau ordered the bank to return to the 16 million consumers impacted. That includes 11 million car loan borrowers. The Bureau says that the bank must pay $1.3 billion for improperly charging fees and interest, wrongfully possessing vehicles and failing to give refunds for some types of charges when a loan ended early. Wells Fargo will pay another $200 million for illegal home mortgage practices. The Bureau says for at least seven years, the bank improperly denied mortgage loan modifications, which in some cases led to consumers losing their homes to wrongful foreclosures. More than $500 million will go to victims of illegal overdraft fees. The bank is accused of charging some customers even when they had enough money in their account to cover their transaction. The settlement also includes a $1.7 billion fine. That's the largest penalty the Consumer Financial Protection Bureau has ever levied against a bank. The bank said today that it has already resolved many of the infrastructure issues that led to the abuses and that it continues to reform. The Consumer Financial Protection Bureau called the bank a, quote, repeat offender and urged consumers who are still experiencing problems to submit complaints on their website. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.